And the third method for finding probability is subjective. And the definition of subjective probability is a probability based on a guess or an estimate from some knowledge or relevant circumstance. So for example, if, you know, if you're predicting who's going to win a football game and it's based on the fact that the star player is out for one particular team, then you know, you've got some insider information. I can't use the classical method because I don't have a bunch of existing football games of this you know, team that would be on par with each other. I can't use the empirical rule because how do I get them to repeat this game? And every time they repeat it, you know, something's gonna be different. So the best I can do is take some known information like, oh, since this guy's out, I'm not expecting the certain team to play as well, so the other team's gonna win. Another example would be if a doctor said, there's a 30% chance you'll catch the flu. So in this case, I'm sure they're not you know, using a classical approach. Maybe they're using an empirical approach based on how many patients they've had, but I don't know that a doctor's taking the time to count that up. They're probably just thinking, you know, oh, it's somewhere around a quarter of a percent, but let's go a little higher. But you know, there's no mathematics behind this value.